Hello, my loves. I'm Andrea, and welcome to Life As I Know It. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. So today, I have for you a Walmart $1 haul. So I see people always go to Walmart. They find stuff for a dollar, $5, $10, all kinds of products. And me, here and there, I might find a t-shirt or something like that. So the sales lady's up front. She's marking down stuff. So people start swimming around her. So she's like, you know what? I can't mark my stuff here. She left, took a cart with her. So in the shopping cart, I found this. This purple umbrella was for a dollar. Misty Harbor. And hey, so there were several of them. And you know what? It's a good umbrella. It's small. You can fit this inside your purse and even in your car. So I did grab three to keep in my car in case I see somebody out there that need them. They can have them and you cannot beat this for $1 at all. It does not, oh, it was originally $12. So that was my first find. So she marked her little stuff and everything like this. So I go, I see she's marking down dresses. So she's like, you can't touch anything until everything marked. I got enough of time, I can wait. So she marked down the dresses. They had these dresses in all different colors. So I waited about a good 20 minutes. I was so happy to get these dresses for my daughter. I come home. I, let me tell you, I'm like, okay, I got her some dresses and I got them for a dollar and I'm all excited. My daughter looked at me and said, I haven't worn dresses like that since I was 14. Really? <laughs> really, girl? I said, you could wear these like on a Saturday or something, or when you just have to run out and do something or whatever. No, I don't want them dresses. I said, no problem. So here's one of the dresses. Here's the bag. I thought this was cute, you know, a little bag like that. And the dress is midway to your knees. And then that's the front. So I said, you know what? I'm not gonna stick these dresses and get well. I'm gonna take them back to Walmart and let somebody else have them because you cannot beat that for a dollar and I don't know how much Goodwill is going to um, sell them for. But I kept two of these dresses because I bought different sizes because I really wasn't sure. So here's the second one. I love this. With some sandals, kick around. That's the way the bags are. I thought they were nice. They were originally $10.96. So I kept two. I took the rest of them back to the store. And as a sell lady, I told her, you know, I bought the dresses, they're a dollar. I'd rather for somebody to get them than throw them back. And she looked, she pulled them out. She was like, oh, I like wearing dresses. Oh, wait a minute. I was like, see, that's what I'm talking about. Let somebody else get a good deal. So that was my one adventure. A couple days later, I go back to Walmart, a different Walmart, for some other stuff that I forgot to get. And here they are marking down stuff again. So the guy had long cardigan sweaters with the fur around the neck. I was like, nobody want that. So I went and got my stuff, went put my pictures up to get them um, developed because I needed some more pictures. So as I'm going to the register, because I know it's going to take a minute for the pictures, I see this lady come past. She got the cardigan sweaters. She must have opened more boxes, all thrown across her cart. It was two different colors. But on the edge of the cart going around, she got these gorgeous Christmas dresses, and that's what they were. I looked at her, I said, what are you going to do with all those dresses? I mean, I get it, it's a dollar, but what the hell are you going to do with all them damn dresses? It must have been two large boxes of them dresses that she, I lie to you not. When I say around the edges, all the way going around for me to notice that she had that many dresses. Really, what you going to do with all this stuff? Oh, my kids' school have a pageant every year, and it's be great. First of all, we don't even know if these damn kids are going to be in school next year doing pageants and all that other crazy stuff. Really? You're going to take all those dresses? There's women in here that probably got children to get these dresses. So I say to her, are there any more of those dresses back there? Oh, yeah, yeah, they got more back there. Oh, yeah, and they got the ones with the unicorns. Okay, I go back there. You know, ain't not one of them damn dresses is there. Why is she lying? Not one of those dresses was there that she had around that cart. So one of the girls that worked there, I described the dress to her. She said, no, but I would love to have one of those dresses. I walked right around, went to the line. She's standing in the line. I said, you know, ain't no one of those dresses back there. Really? Really? Are you going to use all those dresses? Oh, I guess I can give you a dress. No, you won't give me two. 
And then when I thought about it, walked away, I should have made her give me four. Because I'm seriously, she had whatever cases they came out of. She had all of them. Are you serious? These people were here. They got kids and grandkids. So I got the dresses. I went back, showed the girl. And I'm like, she up at the register. Go get them. So I did see the dress that she was talking about that had the unicorns on. But of course, the one she had was the most gorgeous ones. That's why she grabbed them all. Hey, I said, people, or that is to some extent really... You took all those dresses. People were here. Other people that got grandchildren, children that like dresses like that because they wear the Christmas dresses. But I digress. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the dresses. And then we're going to go from there. You ready for this? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that dress. So look at it with this underneath here. Oh my goodness. So these dresses were originally. 1996 so i got a five and i got a four now these two were left at the register because there was a man two people ahead of her that had all those cardigans and he had some of the dresses and now all the dresses were coming up a dollar so these two didn't come up and when i got to the register they were there so and this is a size four now i grabbed these because i'll be able to get it to somebody at the church so the dresses that i got from her i did get two these are the two i got from her and one's a seven and one's a 10. I wish I'd have grabbed two tens instead, but these are gorgeous. So my um, niece will get one and then my um, god granddaughter, she'll get the other one. Cause these dresses are gorgeous. And as soon as, like I said, my daughter was like, oh my God, mom, those are dresses that you would have bought us. Yes, because I think they're so pretty. And even a lady was like, oh, those are the Christmas dresses. Yeah, cause y'all probably didn't sell a lot because people didn't go places and things like that and to get them for a dollar come on but i mean seriously she shouldn't have took all those dresses now when she said the unicorn this is what i thought she was talking about i'm like just like a damn dress to you they had these these were these are two piece this is a size 10 and this was 9.98 so this is what i thought she was talking about but when I went back, the um, sales lady, she had found the dresses she was talking about. So it's the exact same thing. They're like that. But at the end, they have the unicorns right here. It's made the same way as the other dress. And then you see the, oops, there you go. You see the unicorn at the bottom. And I'm not sure. And then it has a bow. I'm quite sure the other dresses had bows in the back too. Yeah, they did have bows in the back. And the same thing with this. This was um, 1996. This is gorgeous. Look at that. Look at the colors like that. You cannot beat that. So like I said, I got both of the girls a dress. So one I know would definitely without a doubt fit. Hopefully the other one will fit her. So I was so happy with that. I got my dresses, got my pictures, and then I left the store. And then I remember <laughs> I went in there to get a container and a gift card. So I put all my stuff in the car. So as I'm getting, they didn't have a container. And then I'm leaving to go get the gift card. A guy flags me down and says, go to the middle, go over there. They're marking down clearance stuff. They got it for $1. I'm looking at him and saying, no, no, go over there. So I said, okay, let me go back. I knew what he was talking about. And they were marking down. They had uh, pants, jeans. They had the... Uh, Camouflage pants that you want, I guess, if you're a hunter and stuff like that, because they had fleece and stuff inside of them. They had men's uh, flannel shirts. And then they had baby stuff. And what I say, I'm looking at this, I said, shit, somebody always having a damn baby. So I grabbed some baby stuff. Now, I have two girlfriends that are about to be grandmoms. So I grabbed two of these. These are newborn. Hopefully, they have winter babies. But you cannot beat that. Look at that. I got... What is it? Four. It doesn't tell you um, the price on here. I hate when it does that. But this is newborn. And this is Children of Mines made by Carter. And like I said, four of these, $4. So like I said, I have two girlfriends that are having um, grandkids. And then I got this for my God grand baby. <laughs> And this is a size six to nine months. So I got this for him too. Because you cannot beat this. So they'll get that. And then for my um, grand nephews. And yeah, my grand nephews. Because I got the grand niece uh, address. 
these are pajamas and they were this one was 496 you can't beat that this is a 3t for one dollar so when winter comes he'll get that and then here was a shirt i'm quite sure it had a bottom to it and if not this was one of the christmas ones and this was 496 so it was just a shirt i grabbed two of these because i believe two of my nephews are the same size um, so this is $4.96, but you cannot still be two pieces. And I got them for a dollar. Got them for a dollar. I was so excited. I'm serious. I really was. So these are little fleece pants. I think I got the wrong size, but I feel these are great. I'm in the house when I'm out there doing grass or whatever, or if you have to run to the store, like I tell my daughter, but, and you really don't feel like getting dressed because you know you're coming back. And this is Mitch Match. And this was $9.97, so I got the bottom for a dollar. And there was the top. Cuddle coffee and cuddle and coffee. And this was, I think it was the same price. Yep, $9.97. $1. Or you can wear these as pajamas. But it does feel like the material, it does feel nice and soft. Then I got some pajama bottoms. These are little slugs on there. And $9.97. That was the original price. A little Christmassy, but that's okay. You got some sweatpants with pockets. And the bottom turned down. And these were, let's see, let's see. Has to have a price. Oh, you know what? With the things on the table. I'm all over the place with this this was but it had to have a tag one here right here but it was a dollar so i don't know what the original price was and some more of the baby stuff this is 24 months look at that a little what do they call these onesies <laughs> 3.99 this is cute and then i found this is a 3t And this one did not have a price on here. Oh, four fifty. dollars So that wasn't bad. I don't think any of these is bad because you're not paying the regular price for them. This is four fifty. dollars This is another four t And you got them for a dollar. A dollar. And trust me, they were snatching this stuff up. Then I got two of these little sweatpants. Like I said, two of them, I believe, are the same size. So these were four fifty. dollars So I really cleaned up in the clothes section and whatever they can wear now if not i'll just hold it for christmas and put it in their christmas bag and talking about christmas doo, doo, doo. yes one dollar in the clearance section so that was a great find in clearance section because we can paint that and i found these they had these in all different colors so i said you know what i'm gonna gra I grab this and I'm going to get one of those stickers from um, the dollar store that says um, number one dad and hit a couple of them. I don't know. Put the stickers on there and they'll be part of Father's Day gift. But one of, besides the dresses being a great, great find. What? What? A snowsuit. A baby snowsuit. I mean, it's a small size. This was 1944. So I saved eighteen dollars and forty-four cents. Only thing is, this is zero to three months, and I'm not sure are the baby all the babies summer babies. If they're summer babies, then I'll hold on to it because, like I said, somebody is always having a baby. So if I can't give it to one of my girlfriends, I will check with one of my coworkers and see if somebody's having a little girl because these clothes will be given to someone. You cannot meet this. All this stuff for a dollar. I should have took a rank of all the tags and see how much it was and then give you a grand total of how much it would have cost me and what I got it for. But if I get lucky like that again, I will definitely do it. But this to me was a great haul from Walmart, especially since this is like my first haul. So kudos to Walmart. So with that being said, Thank you for stopping by and spending time with me. If you're new, leave a comment, 
subscribe to my channel, hit that notification button. So every time I upload a video, you can go on this journey with me. And if you're returning, like always, you are appreciated. Thank you for stopping by and spending time with me. Remember, it costs nothing to be kind. Have a blessed day. And I will see you in our next video.